This video is to show Lamborghini Gallardo engine timing from 2004 to 2008 model year cars. In the video, it will explain the lineup marks on the camshaft and on the crankshaft. Over here with the cylinder head off the car, we're going to show you what it looks like when you put the camshaft lock tool on and how the camshafts are positioned. You'll see cutout marks on top of the camshaft where the tool bolts to. You'll also notice the little U's at it so you can access the cylinder head bolts to remove the cylinder head. That's a good indication right there. Also another way to look is if you have access to the back of the plugs if they're removed, the cutout lines will be perfectly level with the back of the head on each bank. Next, we're going to show what's involved on basically the crankshaft position. So, on bank one, which would be the passenger side of the car, underneath here, there'll be a lock pin that will lock the crankshaft. In the next video, you'll see it's basically a little U cut inside the crankshaft that this pin locks into. So, this is what the crankshaft looks like where the U is cut out where the lock pin goes into to lock the crankshaft. Now we're going to show you where it's located on the engine. Once the crankshaft lock pin is in, we're going to go over and show the cam lock tools that have to be installed in each bank from bank two to bank one. Each of the camshaft lock tool bolts have to be tightened to 17 foot pounds. Once that is done, we're going to basically start with the camshaft timing. And all right, so the next part of this cam timing video will show you tighten the cam variables by hand and you back them out one eighth of a turn. If you get it hand tight, when you have to turn back, you would at that point pull the tensioner lock, which I already did, to extend the tensioner out, but preload on the chain. With the variator tool on bank two intake camshaft, it's going to put 30 foot pounds of clockwise force to put full extension on the chain so the tensioner can do its job. I'm going to come in bank two exhaust cam at 44 foot pounds and give basic initial tightening. He's gonna hold that at 30. I'm gonna come in at 44. While he's holding that. It's one. Two. Next, we're gonna move to bank one. We're gonna be on the exhaust camshaft variator. And at that time, you would pull the tensioner, which I already did, to get full extension. And once that is done, we're going to start with bank one intake camshaft, and then move to the exhaust camshaft on bank one. It's a little funny the way that lines up. Exhaust cam. Next, we're going to remove the cam locks. Once the cam locks are removed, we're going to wind up basically torquing these bolts in order from bank two. The exhaust cam, 59 foot pounds. Intake cam, 59 foot pounds. And then bank one, intake cam, 59 foot pounds.
Next will be a 90 degree torque angle. In the same order. The camshaft spin during this, the bolts have to be replaced and the whole sequence has to start over. Once final torque is complete, remove the crankshaft pin, rotate the engine until the marks line up again. Make sure the cam lock tools install easily, and that's how you know the time is done. That's the correct way to do Lamborghini Gallardo engine timing on a B-Town.